talk to you after the game on Saturday and, and talking about Devin. I can sense a little emotion in, in your voice there. A guy that you worked with from the start, does all injuries sure. suck, but did that one kind of hit you because you've seen what he, this guy's Yeah, just because he, you know, he's such a special person. Um, you know, after the game I was talking to him, the type of person he is, he, he was more worried about the team than himself and about me. So, you know, he's one of those guys that you just you love being around and he he's, he's inspires me every day. He's, he's a guy that's, that's why you coach to be around guys like that. And, you know, I wish I was half as tough as that guy, man. It was, it's unbelievable. And when you see a guy like that, it's just, it was, yeah, it was emotional. It was very emotional because if I can be half the guy he is, I'm a, I'm a decent guy. You guys had that discussion about what his future is because everyone was wondering football or track before the season started. And sure. Now with the injury. No, no, we haven't. But I, I know this. Whatever he decides to do, he's going to kill it and be successful. Um, you know, I expect him to go to the Olympics and win a gold. I hope he still plays football, but he'll do what's best for him. And uh, what, what he's done for this team off the field and how he's handled this, I mean, he's, he's made me better, better person, and he's made all our players better people.